family is still outside playing games like soccer. Jesus Christ. How did George Pick manage to kick the soccer ball when the soccer ball comes to me? I'm doing my best to do more skills, mum and dad. And I'm the winner. Ha ha. I didn't know that my son, George Pick, can do this. Thanks mom and dad for letting me win. I can barely know how to play soccer properly. This is not fair. Why does my stupid mom and my stupid dad love George Pick win? This is cheating, and nobody gave a crap about it. George Pig is such a crybaby just like my stupid mom. I want to find a way to ruin George Pig's fun day. After a few minutes of looking and searching. Well, I already know what I'm going to do. I'm going to commit credit card fraud by stealing my mom's credit card. Hopefully, she won't found out that I was stealing her stuff. Since I found a perfect way to find, I will turn off my computer, then I will go to my parents' bedroom, and look for my mom's credit card. Before I need to go, I have to check outside to see if my parents, including George Pig, are coming back inside the house. I wish my family can still stay outside during the fresh air time. So George Pick, would you like to get back inside the house, and then we'll make you some iced lemonade tea? How about that? Yes, I would like to, cause the outside is so hot that the current temperature is 35 degrees. Alright, thanks for letting me know George Pig. Time to get back inside the house quick before the temperature is becoming too hot. And Dad, could you clean the soccer ball up, and put back the soccer ball right into the equipment room please? Well okay then, thank you George Pig for letting us play soccer with you. It was enjoyable, but the outside is hot. Off we go, to our house, and I'll do something quick before it's time to make iced lemonade tea. Oh snap! My family is coming back to my house. Great, I gotta do it fast as fast as possible. I don't want my parents to caught me if I attempted to steal my mom's credit card. I gotta find my mom's credit card immediately before my mom comes here to clean up. So honey, and George Pick, I'm going to me and your bedroom to clean up before I can make iced lemonade tea for George. I will be back in a real quick. By the way George Pick, I will go to your mother and your father's bedroom to get myself ready. Don't worry, it won't that long because it's an early moment. Do not worry George Pick, your mother is still in a hurry. I'm going to the bathroom to wash my hands. My hands looks quite dirty. HMM, I don't know how long it takes for my mom to complete, but we'll see. Maybe another 3 to 5 minutes or so. I'm going to watch television because I'm so bored after playing soccer with my parents. I gotta find my credit card before my mom went to her or my dad's bedroom to get prepared. I'm not gonna get caught, though. Holy crap. Yes. I found my mom's stupid credit card. Perfect. That credit card belongs to my mom, because she had over $800 all over her bank account. Now I'm going to deposit the cash with my mom's credit card. Peppa Pig. What are you doing here in me and your father's bedroom? Now Peppa Pig, what did you do? Have you sneaked into me and your father's bedroom and hide something? You better not make up a lie. Um. I'm not going to explain the full details, but I have to. So I sneak to this bedroom, and explore the room. But I didn't steal or hide something, okay. You know. I wasn't in my room the whole time until I came here to tell you why you were here. But anyways, just leave the bedroom, I'll just clean up to start freshing. Whatever, I'm going. And I hope nothing happens to me. I'm suspicious right now, I really hope Peppa Pig won't do something stupid. But whatever. I will open the closet to clean those things up.
there. It's all cleaned. Now I'm going to the kitchen to make ice lemonade tea for George Pig. Alright George Pig, I'm done checking. Now I will go to the kitchen to make an ice lemonade tea for you. Alright, thanks. Now I can enjoy myself drinking an iced lemonade tea during the hot temperature. Now let's wait until my mum is done making an iced lemonade tea for me. It better be a lemonade tea, not too salty. Mom, I think the kitchen room is hot. Can you turn on the air conditioner please? It's getting hot right now. Okay then, thanks for letting me know. I'll bring the air conditioner for you. Maybe it's because the sun is making the weather exhausted. I wish the summer can have fresh air rather than the exhausted weather. I bought the air conditioner to turn on for you. Finally, it's time. Okay, I turned on the air conditioner for you. Now I'm going to make a nice lemonade tea for you. And mom, could you add a mango flavor right on to the iced lemonade tea? It would be perfect if the mango flavor is added. Probably yes, I think we still have mango fruit right inside the fridge. I'll go and check. There it is. There are only two mango fruits in there. I think I can use the mango just to slice and make it in flavor. I think I'm going to bring this to the counter, but I need something to slice the mango. Now let's slice the lemon and the mango into pieces. Alright George, I finished making a nice lemonade head with a mango flavor on it. I hope you like it. Now you may proceed to drink the iced lemonade tea with mango flavor in it that I made. Oh boy, I wonder what it tastes like. I hope something's good inside. Wow, I didn't know that there was a mango flavor inside the iced lemonade tea. I'm gonna say that this iced lemonade tea with mango flavor tastes perfect. I'm glad that you enjoyed drinking an iced lemonade tea with mango flavor on it. Now I'm going to drink it as well, cause I'm thirsty. Wow, my mom wanted to drink an iced lemonade tea as well, how terrific of her. I'm enjoying myself drinking a nice lemonade tea as well. It tastes like a nice lemonade tea with mango flavor in it. That was close. I'm glad that my mom or George Pig didn't see me out there. They are just drinking iced lemonade tea, but whatever anyways. Well, now that I got my mom's credit card, time to go to the bank, then I will deposit my cash because I still have enough money to deposit. Uh, I don't know how to drive a car, cause I'm too young to have a license. That's why I'm not driving the car. Come on. Think, think carefully before leaving the house area. I found another way to go to the bank, I could walk straight to the bus station and wait until the bus arrives here in any minute and I better make sure that my mom or my dad won't see me leaving the house without their permission. Honey, I will go to my room, then bring my credit card and we are going to the store to buy foods for dinner. Yes, but first, we need to call George Pig and Peppa Pig to go downstairs to the living room, which we are already in. Okay, understand, dinner. Yes, but first, we need to call George Pig and Peppa Pig to go downstairs to the living room, which we are already in. Okay, understand. I'm going to my room, then I will find my credit card. I'm gonna wait until my wife already found her credit card. I'm gonna continue watching TV until she finds it. Holy snap! No, my credit card is missing. What happened to my credit card? 
Oh my god, you kidding me right? My credit card is missing. I don't know where did I put it. I put it right here, but now it's missing. Oh my god I need to tell my husband quick. Daddy, please come upstairs to my room quick. It's something serious that I have to address about. I don't know why did she just call me to get upstairs, but we'll just see. Honey, is there something wrong I can just- The heck. Your credit card was missing. Honey, what happened to your credit card? It's missing, you already put it there, but why is it missing? Well, I don't know, I already putted it there, but my credit card is gone and stolen. Can you help me? I think we need to tell George Pig and Paper Pig about what happened to your credit card, and we may have to report this to the police department immediately. Yeah, but it will take a long time to get my credit card back since it was already stolen. We have to get there quick before it's too late. I know, but we have to tell George and Paper about your credit card missing. They are going to be suspicious when we tell them. Come along honey, we're not joking around. Ah yes, there's the bus stop, now I'm going to sit down the bench and wait until... Wait, where are the benches? What happened to them? God darn it you stupid cowards, no benches at the bus stop? Fine then, I'll just stand here and wait until the bus arrives. So George, when your mother told me what happened, she found out that her credit card was missing. She went to our room, then opened the drawer, and it's gone. But have you called the cops earlier? Like didn't you get a chance to call the cops? Yeah, but we forgot to call the cops after checking all over in our room. It's a shame that I lost my credit card due to the somebody stealing it just to pay very expensive. And I checked your room to see if your mom's credit card was there, but it's missing, and it's not there. But have you seen Peppa Pig? She's not in me and her room anymore. She must have go on a walk until she's tired. Wait, you said that Peppa already left the house to go on a walk spree? Is this true or not? Um, I changed my mind. I don't think so, maybe she just went somewhere. But hold on a minute. What if she actually took and steal my credit card? I think she sneaked into our room to steal it. What? There, actual, heck, are you serious right? Yes I am, I'm serious, and I got really shocked after Peppa steal my credit card. I think she was lying to me when I go to my room, she said she was exploring, but yet, she lied. What? Honey, did you tell us that Paper stole your credit card when she sneaked into our bedroom, and made you fall for her trap? Yes, she actually did, she was the one who made me fall for her trap, I guess she stole my credit card while sneaking into our room to open the drawer. Oh my freaking god. How dare the Paper Pig stealing your own credit card like that? I guess she wanted to commit credit card fraud, huh? I know right? We may have to call the cops on her to teach her a strip lesson. Holy crap, I can't believe that Peppa would do this. We need to stop her before things will get worse. Now, I'm going to call the cops immediately. It's something very serious. <laughs> Hello. This is the police officer from the police department. What can I help you? And is there something serious we want to deal with? Well, my daughter, which is Pepper, just stole my wife's credit card. And she wanted to use it just to buy more depositing the cash. Wow. Just wow. Another illegal activity confirmed. Thank you for informing us about the situation. We will be on our way to get her arrested. You're always welcome. Right now, I have to go. See ya. Alright honey and George, we gotta get going. Hurry up and we will get in our car. There it is. The bank service, where the bank has people depositing their own cash. Let's go there. At least I'm here at the bank service, which means that I can get a chance to deposit my cash. Lucky for me.
But, there aren't many people going to the bank service since they already have enough money to purchase or buy stuff they want. I'm not even that surprised. Next, please. But there aren't much people waiting their turn. Oh well, I will do it today. Hi, and welcome to the bank service. What can I help you today? So I went here because there aren't many people here because of the hot temperature. And that's why I have to deposit my cash or my money. And here is my credit card that you've wanted to give out receipts. Well okay, thank you. Now I can just uh, insert your credit card right into the credit card machine. Okay, now that I grab the credit card, it's time to insert the credit card right into... Hold on, I think something suspicious right here. I gotta take a look at the credit card's name. So wait, if the credit card doesn't belong this to this person, then I think she actually committed credit card fraud by stealing her mom's credit card. I think it's time to confront her by asking her a question about why this credit card doesn't belong to her. Excuse me, I want you to explain this, why is this credit card doesn't belong to you, and why is it stolen? But what are you talking about? I wasn't trying to. Hold up. Is that a credit card that doesn't belong to me? Oops. I accidentally stole my mother's credit card. Now I'm in deep trouble. Yes you are, and what do you have to say after you stole your mother's credit card? Damn it, I have ran out of options. I guess I should just, um, run 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 run. And stay away from this degenerate coward. You kidding me right? You just wanted to get away for committing credit card fraud. Well then, have it your way you fool. God, I am so annoyed because there was a theft stealing her mom's credit card. This is driving me nuts already. Hurry and respond. I'm not going to say this crap again and again. Hi. We are inside the police car because we are the cops. Anyways, what can I help you? Well, some theft just stole her mom's credit card, and when I found out that the credit card doesn't belong to her, it's completely stolen. I just found out. One explanation later. Holy crap. I can't believe that. Also, I know that there's a theft named Peppa Pig who stole her mom's credit card. That credit card doesn't belong to her. Yes, but when I tell her why would she do that, she ran away and got away with it, but she's right at the outside of the bank service. Could you pull over and arrest her? Well okay then, thanks for informing us about the situation between her and the credit card fraud. We will pull over so we have to investigate. Anyways, goodbye. Thank you, and stay out of trouble, okay? This is getting out of control right now, ah, uh, definitely not a good day. Hold it right there. You are not going anywhere. God damn it, not those stupid fools again, Ugh. I said freeze. You better be silent or else we will under arrest you. Good. Now that you are silent, we just got a call from your parents. They said that your mom's credit card was stolen, and we also got a call from the bank service, they said that the credit card you hold doesn't belong to you. It turns out that it was stolen and it's considered credit card fraud. But when she was asking you a question about why did you steal your mom's credit card, you ran away while trying to get away with it. Police officers, are you looking for the stolen credit card that a person just stole? If you don't know, I'm from the bank service, and I just got a hold of the stolen credit card that this person has stole. Let me check and see if it's true or not. I'm not gonna bother wasting time. Holy crap! I think that credit card is stolen, and it belongs to Peppa's mom. You are right the whole time because she committed credit card fraud. Now Peppa Pig, what do you have to say after you committed credit card fraud by stealing your mom's credit card? Why aren't you speaking? Just speak right now, and tell us if you did it or not. Come on. Why aren't you speaking? Just tell us right now. Why didn't you respond? Just respond right now. 
We are not going to say this multiple times. Okay, you don't want to reveal or admit the truth. Alright then, I guess the cops are putting you in arrest I guess. Okay, I forgot to tell, I guess I ran out of options, I guess it's time for me to Run 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 and stay away from those stupid fools run 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 Get that stupid theft over here God damn it, you kidding me right now? My stupid mom and dad are here so, I got a hold of your credit card that has a name on it, which is Mrs. Pig. Are you actually the one who owned this credit card? Yes I am, I own the credit card with my name on it, but my daughter just steal it just to deposit the cash. So, where's my credit card? I gotta say, yes, I got a hit of your stolen credit card. But don't worry, you got it back. Oh, there's my credit card. I'm finally glad that I got it back. Well thank you for giving me back my credit card, I was having problems trying to find it, but luckily, it's back. And if you don't know me, I'm from the bank service. I was the new owner when the current owner was taking a day off. Thank you so much for getting my wife's credit card back. Me and my wife were investigating, and it turns out, it was true at all. You're welcome, oh, and one more thing is that the police cops are going to be here in any minute, now I'm going back to the bank service. Great, just great. Thanks to Peppa Pig, we might have to wait until the police cars arrives here in any minute. Yeah, and Peppa Pig. What you are doing is just unacceptable. Stealing somebody's credit card just to buy or depositing the cash is considered credit card fraud, and it's illegal. Alright, Mrs. Pig, did you got your credit card back after your daughter stole it? Yes, I got it back. I was trying to find it, but I don't know where did I put it, because my daughter just took my credit card away and went to the bank service, and my credit card has my name on it. So don't worry, I didn't lose my credit card. And what is your daughter's name after she stole your credit card to deposit the cash? My daughter's name is Peppa Pig. She recently stole my wife's credit card, that's why. Seriously Peppa Pig? You know better that stealing someone's credit card just to buy or depositing the cash is very wrong thing to do. And credit card fraud is a crime and illegal activity, and you will get arrested if you committed the crime. So for this, you are now arrested for six months. What the heck? I'm getting arrested for six months. But that will take me a long time for me to get out. Get in the police car. But you don't even understand this. Well, I guess we can go to the grocery store.